All right, hello everyone out there in YouTube land, the unknown world of YouTube. Just gonna do a video about charismatic uh, experiences over scripture and how they just love their experiences and they love their unscriptural uh, practices that come from Satan, basically. Charismatic uh, speaking in tongues is nothing more than just devil possession and it's a book by uh, Dr. Peter Ruckman called Why I'm Not a Charismatic. Uh, interesting book. Uh, I haven't read the whole thing yet, but uh, I highly recommend it. It's part of a series of books uh, about, you know, one is called Why I'm Not a Catholic, Why I'm Not a Calvinist, Why I'm Not a Candlelight, Why I'm Not a Seventh-day Adventist, Why I'm Not a New Age Global Citizen. Just going over these heretical cults and showing why he's not part of them. And of course, the charismatic movement is a heretical cult. The charismatic movement gets their ability from hell. This way, they don't believe in... Where's the there? They don't believe in this book, okay? They don't believe this book right here. They believe their experiences over God's word. And you confront them on it, you show them verses in scripture where they're wrong, they don't like it because they want their experiences over God's holy word. And they don't like that. And they want to flip around and flop around the floor like a bunch of fish and, and bark like a dog. And if you call them out, they'll say you're blaspheming the Holy Ghost. Uh, you read in Matthew chapter 12 about blaspheming the Holy Ghost, uh, you're not Jesus Christ. If you're a charismatic out there, you're not Jesus Christ, first of all. Secondly, uh, you read it in context. Jesus Christ is saying, neither in this world nor the world to come. Okay, what's that? The millennial kingdom. You can't blaspheme the Holy Ghost unless Jesus Christ is physically on the earth. But of course, the charismatic cult out there, they don't want to adhere to the word of God. They like ripping verses out of context and prove their heresies. So I just wanted to explain that, how the charismatic experience is always trumps scripture. You confront them with God's word about where they're wrong, they'll get mad, they'll say you're blaspheming the Holy Ghost, they'll accuse you of, of basically doing the work of the devil, which is what they're doing this whole time. These charismatic counterfeit gifts are from Satan, plain and simple. So just a quick video I want to do about these charismatic encounters and experiences. Uh, they're not scriptural and they're, it's just a bunch of devil possession, that's all that it is. So just don't be deceived by it. Uh, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.